What's up, heroes? Mike here, and I want to give you guys my first impressions of Aliens Fireteam Elite before I do a review of this game. And not only will you hear from me, but also a couple of my friends in the community that join me playing this. Uh, their name is Big Hertz and Daniel, who goes by the Viper 2K19. You'll hear them speak first before me, and I'll be showcasing some highlights of gameplay footage you know, that we did from the first five missions of this game. So I hope you enjoy this, and look out for that review. All right. Uh, well, what do you think, man? Real quick, your thoughts and your impressions of this. Well, being an alien fan, this is, you know, a dream come true for me. Considering all the other alien games I've played. Mm -hmm. Um. First thing, the sound is what's drawing me to, like into this game fully. Just the nostalgia of the, all the sounds that the the game uh, remade, like to the T. Yeah. And so that's the you know. That right there, I mean, the graphics are, you know, all right, you know. Um, I'm still wanting to know about, like, more of, like, the weapon customizations. And, like, what else we have, to, you know, as far as, you know, looking at your uh, universal abilities and when you unlock these other slots, like, how crazy you can make your build be. Right. So, you know, the pacing on far as unlocking and stuff, I, I feel like it's all right right now. You know, because I don't want to have, you know, be playing like, you know, just, we just did four missions total. And then all of a sudden I got all the stuff to unlock. And then I'm trying to play around with, you know, what fits in what. So right now, I like, like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of loving it. It's like a fresh, you know, a rough air for me for survival games like this. Cause I played right. Killing, and I, played killing, yeah, I played Killing 4 before and, you know, Call of Duty Zombies. And, you know, but it's just this feels more like fun to play like worthwhile yeah definitely get that to me like like kurt said this is like this game is like a, a breath of fresh air like it's a lot of fun to play yeah i like i'm a fan of the franchise like the alien movies yes and the games and stuff like that uh, this might make you laugh though i was about 16 no, when, when did alien isolation actually come out i know it was when the ps4 first got released wait when what I when know. what game came out Alien Isolation. 2014. So I would have been like... Seven years ago. I would have been like about 24, somewhere like that, I think. I love me horrors and all that, but like, when I got Alien Isolation, I was I was terrified to play it, because like, just trying to like, not get seen by Alien and getting killed and that, like... I, I love me horrors and stuff like that, but for some reason, that Alien Isolation game made us, ter made us terrified, and it had his paranoid and all that, like, where the hell is he, where the hell is he, you know that, and like, you're trying to keep watching all that, and then all of a sudden he just pops up behind you. But, to my, in my eyes at the moment, I would probably play this game in Call of Duty, in Battlefield, by fall. That's all I'm gonna I mean, say. I mean, I don't my, even know if you can, I don't even know if you can compare those games to this game, though. No, I mean, like, in the, like, the zombie, um, oh, okay. part of it. Multi well, Got you. More, you know, more really know the multiplayer for Call of like, the multiplayer, like, Team Deathmatch and all for Call of Duty is, anyways. <laughs> yeah. Like, like, as a, like, as a, as a co-op, um, zombie mode, I, this is smashing it so far for me. I prefer to play this than Call of Duty Zombies. Got you, got you. In terms of like a co-op, like survival kind of wave-based type thing yeah. when it comes to like where the zombies were, yeah. That's fair. All right, man. Awesome, awesome. Real quick though, because I know Daniel, you gave your impressions earlier and then Big Hurts before he left, gave his. Uh, So far, it's a lot of fun. I was a little concerned because I watched I, I watched iGen's review of this game and they gave it a seven and I was concerned about the negatives that person talked about in that review. As far as like lack lackluster story, um, kind of repetitive gameplay in a bad way, and those sort of things. I think he said some of the progression. I think, um, and this enemy types and whatnot. But this is a lot of fun. I mean, it is repetitive, but it is actually repetitive in a fun way. So I don't think it's a bad way. And yeah, the story is not really all that great. But these type of games, they tend not to be compared to like other types of games. So. Story-wise, I mean, I wasn't expecting nothing super great or fantastic anyway. Just something like serviceable, functional. And it's kind of like that. Um, gameplay, though. Oh, my God. Gameplay. 
it's so fun dumb fun arcade like uh the online works fine the only time i experience lag or any type of weird glitches where my character seems like it's moved like teleport when i was here when i'm in the base for some reason but not when we're actually doing the missions it's kind of kind of weird like i don't know what's going on hopefully they come off a patch for that to fix that but uh yeah a lot of fun um solid gameplay the guns feel good oh my god the sound effects the audio like it's so on point with how the uh, movies are sounds like the guns from the movies and like that the atmospheres feel great um probably could have been you know done a little bit better more polished as far as the environments the atmospheres but overall visuals are pretty good and this is a ps5 version of the game i'm playing so it's, pretty, it's usually a lock 60 fps until you get into like crazy ass fights and starts losing dropping frames that's uh hopefully be fixed an update because that's another negative i would say is like you drop frames when you're in an intense fight with all these damn aliens swarming at you so but still though a lot of fun um and daniel just teleported <laughs> on my side uh shit like that they need to fix that uh because yeah like, I, i'm hoping they'll fix some updates whatnot like but right now it runs fairly good like for this to be you know the dev team's first game uh first game they made their indie studios indie game and they're basically you know this is their first outing i think it's a solid good outing i want this game to be successful uh so for first impressions i'm really digging it it's doing it for me uh it has that left for dead type of style whatnot but it's got that alien skin or alien kind of uniqueness to it which is very good Oddly enough, it's three player clubs instead of four, which I don't fully get that still, but still a lot of fun. And Daniel just teleported again. Uh, so uh, they need to, yeah, they just need, there's some minor bugs and glitches they need to fix like that. It's mainly, I notice here in the base. When you're here in the base, there's like glitches like that, but nothing really game breaking. When you're actually doing a mission, I didn't really notice any bugs or glitches. Um, just the frames drop when it's like you're in a tense fight with aliens so yeah visuals gameplay is solid uh makes me want to come back and play more so i'll do a full review of this though once uh, you know i fully explore everything after beat the campaign load my character like see what a full build looks like basically and try out the horror mode too but yeah so far i'm digging it uh it's 40 dollars, so it's a nice budget price if you just want the standard edition of it available on all major consoles except for switch so you know pc ps4 ps5 xbox one xbox series x and s stuff like that uh yeah so a good price choice i think um if you want to wait for a sale wait for a sale but right now i say if you got some friends play within this pick it up but like i said hold off from all my full review until later on but yeah I'm really digging it it's doing it for me <laughs> you hear the steam hissing <laughs> we're like oh <laughs> oh shit! Damn things! That's what you get. He said I don't mind. <laughs> Fuck, brawler! God damn it! Here, I'm about to use a. Um, or are we Med kit. Here, Staff Sergeant. We're good to go. Oh, uh, oh my god. Alright, now we gotta go to the back. Get to the back. <laughs> Come on, Daniel! <laughs> oh, he got him! Shoot him! Your mom's a hole. Get off me! Oh god! I don't think they have dicks. We need Hulk three. Right now, I know, I know. Oh God! Oh, we did it! Holy shit! I was being choked the fuck out. Damn, they're about to die, and we fucking did it. Oh my God! Got you. Where's my lunch money, huh? Where's my lunch money? All right. Like a damn, like there was a Family Guy moment there with Stewie, like, "Oh, where's my money, man? Huh? Where's my money? Huh? Where's my money, man?" Huh? <laughs> oh.